Hello everyone, uh, this is Mahmoud talking. Today in this video I will demonstrate the process of recovering corrupted or defective license. I have suffered from this issue due to uh, mishandling of the uh, Dixie 5 license received from the supplier. So fortunately by the end of this video you can be familiar with the process of recovering the uh, the license, the license for DZ5. So let's go on and let's get started. First of all, uh, when you download the DZ5 uh, license from the online delivery, the provider will deliver to you the password and serial number. Those two informations will be entered here. Uh, and after you enter the online software delivery, you can download the uh, the uh, the license directly to your drive, to your disk drive. Once they have been downloaded, you can at that time transfer them to any external drive, flash memory or something like this. But due to any unknown reason or due to any unwanted reason, if the software, the license corrupted, at that time you will get a symbol like this once you click check here on the software main software you'll uh, see that the, the license is corrupted so in order to recover the license uh, you need to follow the following the the the, the proceeding uh, procedure so let's first of all start with this you will select the uh, the, the, the uh, license go to license key and recovery you will have this window popped up and once this window opened you need to take a screenshot for that window i'm here now hiding some uh, some uh, some information so uh, later on you need to take a screenshot with full detailed information please do not close the window otherwise you need to generate or send a new so closing the the, the file from here, you require new gen generation of the new request code. So please keep the window open. Once you have taken a screenshot, send this screenshot to Simmons Support Center. So at at the first, you need to have an I an um, account inside Simmons. Later on, you will request support request and create a new request. Late after this. You need to go to license sub uh, selection, go to authorization, license key, and push next. Once you hit next, you need to fill out the required information. For instance, you will write, okay, I have a defective, li a defective license. Make sure that you have final revision. Uh, do you have the license key still showing? If yes, then you will take a screenshot and drop it in this area. If not, then you need to share the identification or let's say the, the certificate that you have it along with your license key at, at, the, at the beginning, at the first when you purchase the, uh, the license key. Later on, write some description here and push next. When you push next, your information, your personal information will be entered even manually or through Google Chrome directly. And at the last, uh, you will be able to, you will receive an email. And that email 